Hello, my beautiful people from Otoshebo Mama. Thank you for watching our YouTube channel. Please do not forget to subscribe and press the notification button. Thank you. One love. Bye bye. So you all I greet you now, my people. I say make I come make this video this evening. Though I did busy, sir, but say make I just make. Yeah, I just make this video concerning uh, some Nigerian pastors, the way where they go this time around. Eh? The way where some of our Nigerian pastors they go, where they, they do their own things. Sometimes we not come they even they understand them because they say too much of everything is bad. Too much of everything is bad because the way where Nigerian pastors, many of them not come they behave. The thing is not going to, not going to clear. It can't be like television where it's not clear. You know, sometimes all this money, 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 where all of them just they solicit for. We, the fee, say, somebody like me, me, the fee, say, now to just invest for their children. That one not, sometimes not be work of God. Not be work of God. Because... You know, if he said uh, you want to do work of God, say everything has to be money, 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 money. I know saying that money, you will take the move from one place to another. But sometimes you just have to have that in your mind that, okay, everything will be money, money. Huh? You get a video when I watch now. Even our, uh, our adult brother, our adult pastor, Apostle Sulema, a video when me watch, the thing can't surprise me. In the even the third, they say, make you insult me, carry me, go YouTube, go insult me. But at the end of the month, make you pay me my money. Now, so it just can't reach everything and money. Say, may person pay you. Oh, Baba Nyuma, I agree to go, Baba, it's way. Say, everything and money, 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 money. That if they don't insult you, finish for YouTube. The money where they get from inside, may they constantly pay you. Now, so you wanted to run your own things. You see the way where many pastors from Africa, they brainwash. They brainwash our people, eh? It's not good. It's not good. It's not good. They're going to make you feel like, say, if you don't give, you are going to, you are going to, eh? Princess Kate, I greet you. Good evening. They go make you feel like say if you not give, you go go air fire. They go put that guilty conscience for your heart to even let you know say if you not bring come house of God, na 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 bad thing you commit, you commit the greatest sin. But meanwhile, these people they don't know your own your own pain, your own way of living. They don't know how you take live your life. They don't even care. But their owner bring come, bring come, bring come. Ah, huh? even Apostle Suleiman, I don't they talk say who oh, want something make it make it they pay him. The thing come, he come, he there, he there somehow. He say if you call the name for your page, for your YouTube, you put a picture, na problem, you must pay him. My dear adult brother Apostle Suleiman, everything in life is not about money. Sometimes. You have to earn your respect. You have to have your dignity. You have to have your respect. You have to let people respect you. Because the way you people, pastors in Nigeria, are behaving these days, you people are even making Christianity to look like it's a camouflage. You people are making Christianity to feel like nobody wants to practice Christianity anymore. We have a lot of churches in Africa, but yet, now their poverty plenty pass. Yet, now their problem plenty, plenty pass. Yet, now Africa get the biggest problem, calamity. Yet, now Africa, everybody they run, they come out. Say they want to Europe, so they go enter boats. They pass through Libya, pass through Morocco, pass through deserts. All in the name say they want to come out. What about all this prayer where we all are, all the pastors when they pray? When I come say those prayers not get effect for Africa. You know, can't just get anything to take change up. 
Because why? If God feels my own thinking, my own believing, be say, God just they look Africa say because a lot of pastors are greedy, greedy men of God. Many pastors are greedy men of God. If you call them like this, the next thing they go ask you: Have you paid your tithe? Have you sow your seed? Have you done this offering? Nothing else other than sow tithe, money, money, and all these things. Sowing of seed in our money, paying of tithe in our money. All free, na money, everything na money, money, money. But the person where they bring and come, you na know they ask her whether that person they okay. You na know they ask her. That is the problem that African pastors they have. They only care about themselves. I just see, I see it is in, in in kind of a way that they all just want to profit themselves, make their family to be comfortable in case when they die. The pastors are the one living in the heaven. The truth. They are the one living in the heaven. And that heaven that they are living in is your own contribution. Is your own contribution. Plus all these politicians where they thief money, now they are out of the, those money they go end up. Politicians now when they go give money, make it take work for your local government. You will first carry one third of it. You will carry go give pastor. So how that politicians want to fulfill a promise for, for a local government or for anywhere? Everything about pastors these days, everything circle for money. And if all these pastors die, their children are not going to ever suffer. Now see the common man, the, 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 the brainwash dead their brain say, if you don't give, you die, you go a fire. If you don't give, you die, you, you go air fire. Now the common man get the air fire. Now the poor people get the air fire. We all have to be wise here. Now the common man, the common man, I get the air fire. The poor people, I get the air fire. Now the poor people, they live for the air fire. You know, go just come to church one Sunday, now because he say, ah, uh, that the duo or pastors they just surprise the church member just put maybe one one bag of rice on top of one one chair you not go ever see them for their hand you not go ever see them for their hand rather now sow your seed pay your tithe do your this do your that they don't even know whether an empty stomach you take home that church that day Christianity is not supposed to be kind of money, 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 money. The way Africans, especially Nigerian pastors, they are trying to make you to believe that if you don't have money, sit down for your ass, not come. Me don't see a lot of all these pastors. If you don't get anything to sow, or you even go meet, they say, I beg, give me money. Are they seeing for their TV, live screen when they, they preach? Some go say, I don't get money, I don't get transport. He go say, use leg, waka, they go where you they come. If you don't get money, no come church. They're not they just some of they're not they want help like that. Many of the pastors know they want help. Even before they help you, they go first query you. Then go first query you, then go first ask you, then go first make sure say you talk everything way there your mouth. The whole speech way there your mouth go dry. But they will cause you consider. There before they will come even if you say you want them or you merit them. That's in the house of God. Oh God pepper soup, I greet. That's in the house of God. You know, go ever see pastor, they give free will. Hardly before you go see pastor give free will. Apart from T.B. Joshua, may he so rest in peace. Other pastors, they are just money mugger. They are just pastors that are so hungry, desperate for money. Many of them go tell you, say, eh, if they die, eh, my wife go continue. It can't be say, African churches, not just family business. Now family business, it be. I do for my picking. Now family business is another way of you opening your investment. The real word of God, you are not getting it from them anymore. The real Christianity, you are not getting it from them anymore. You are not seeing the love. You are not seeing the way they preach this time around. Is all centers with money. Every of their preaching this time around, everything centers with money. Why is it like that? African pastors.
Why is it that every time you people preach, all your preaching has to be with money? I'm not going to blame them, but it's just you, we the commoners, that put them in those high distance. That's why somewhere not they even they see self. Because we don't put them for that level of uh, say, now second Jesus, all of them can't be. So they even uh, our adult brother now, our adult pastor, apostle now, they say, Good evening, my dear sister Bella, I greet. Huh? Apostle Suleiman, they say now, if you carry my name, go YouTube. Uh, you go measure my name for your work. Uh, you measure my this. You carry my picture put. Uh, you go pay me. So many everything and money now. Who measure your name, you go come pay you. Who put your picture, you go come pay you. Who even talk good about you, you go come pay you, Abi. Okay, those ones not go pay. So long they can't talk one single thing way be say you know follow una line then una comes as them may they can't pay una deformation of character I bet my people see what in uh, pastors they talk these are pastors that you believe in that we all think that oh yes but every of their thing centers with money look the way they they, they put it in people's hearts that if you especially when it comes to tight. If you not pay tight, you they go air fire. Your tight will not make not pay tight will not make you to go to air fire. All those brainwash has to stop. Brainwashing people that if you don't pay tight, you have to go to air fire. You are going to air fire. There is nothing like that. See what they say that they talk. Oh, uh, I think uh, they say Pastor Orisheja for right now. Person who I see. If you don't pay your tithe, you will die quick. Now, what is a man of God supposed to talk like that? Huh? If you don't pay your tithe, you say you go die quick. That word, now, what is supposed to come out from the mouth, the mouth of a man of God? Now, what is a man of God supposed to tell the word be that say, if you don't pay your tithe, you go die quick? And this is an African people in the talk to. People will be say many now two times in a in a day that they eat. Many they eat maybe one time a day. Then you the third person will never eat since morning. Say if you not pay it tight, you go die quick. Why is it that the rich people always like to put fear? The rich people are the one living in the paradise. All these pastors, they are the one living in the paradise because we put them in that level. We make them to be in the level that they are not supposed to be. But at the end of the day, they are abusing it. They are abusing that level. They are abusing it. Okay, see, another one. Now, Bishop, oh. mm. if you give to the needy and don't pay your tithe, you will soon become the needy. Huh? A bishop for that matter, they say, if you be good Samaritan, you they carry all your money, they give people, they say they help the poor. Say, if you not pay your tax for inside all those things, where you they do for the poor, you go soon become the needy. I beg my people, now those kind preaching, or now those kind word, now in Jesus Christ tell us, say, make we they tell our members, as a bishop, now all this kind of preaching, you can't tell your members, say, if they don't pay their tithe, so long that they help the poor people. So if they don't come pay their tithe, helping the poor, that is love. Christianity has to do with love. Everything about Christianity has to do with love. It doesn't have to do with money, my people. Christianity doesn't have to do with money. It doesn't have to do with everything has to go to the center of money. And all this money, if you they pay him, you they show him, where the money they go? Tomorrow you go here and say, they don't get one private jet. And me why? Me why, my brothers and my sisters? You as a poor man, as a common man, you go the waka they go. But we, they go give us rosary. They go give us uh, stickers. They go give us all these things. Say, make you hold for hand. You go, they use their sticker, their picture, they pray. But then they go with bodyguard. Then they go with security agency. 
Why is it like that? That Nigerian police now, some of the policemen go to uh, be their uh, security agency. Those ones, they guide them, they protect them, they go. These are not people who be say, they say that they serve God. Oh. All these now people, big, big pastors, where they say that they serve God. But at the end of the day, you will become a man, you go enter church, you go go as freely. But then that they get security, that they get bodyguard. Why is it so? Why is it so? Why can't they just live just like the common man, just like you and me, living freely? So long we are serving God Almighty. We should allow God Almighty to protect us. Then instead of us, you now using security, police or soldier, name it all, to now protect ourselves and guide ourselves. If pastor they go, you go to see Sari, they blow, they go. Wow, 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 wow. You go to look, what did they go on? You go even the TSA maybe in a military personnel, they go like that. No. Not be governor, not be military personnel, but in a pastor. Why is it that way? Christianity, the way African pastors are making it to look like, is not is 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 becoming a kind of a show of disgrace. Okay, another one say you cannot make heaven if you don't pay your tithe. When I see this this scare tactics, putting fear into people's hearts. And all these things sent out to money. And those money now they go sit down. Get, get, get. They use viral and paper, they did not have the one way one belong to them. And if they die tomorrow, that church now, come on, my you and me, we not go feel God that out and go preach. We not go go the altar and go preach. Automatically, the church belong to their wife and their children. I just see some of these pastors, they are just using Christianity as their own kind of self-business. Now my business be this. If uh, in case this pastor comes, that his wife go take over. Which is not a good thing. It's not a nice thing to do. It's not a nice thing to do. Because when you, are, when you, when you call yourself as a man of God, Everything don't have to be money. That's why even now we serve, we, we like to win uh, uh, people of the world. We like to follow glitter things. Things where they rain. Things where they say, if, if they heavy, if you they look up. But you just see the one where they say, small but mighty. We not go go follow them. We they run after all these big big pastors, and now we can't put them for weird and day that they can't be said demigod. They can't be demigod, and me when they will be demigod, then they move with security, then they move with police. I'm not sure say uh, Jesus Christ now, our Lord and Savior go they walk out for street, he go say make one police come follow her. No. Why African pastors still they carry police, they carry security, they carry everybody, they carry the follow body? Why? That comma is there, and sometimes somebody like me, I want to know why. Why be say una go they print stickers they sell, una go they print uh, 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 whatever banner, uh, uh, what is the evil necklace? Now put on a picture, people go they buy as a protection. As a kind of now prayer request. But on a way, be say, if they sell those stickers with pictures, with olive oil, with water, with everything. But at the end of the day, una they go with security. Police, they protect una. Soldiers, they protect una. Why is it so? Our African people, our African pastors, why is it so? Okay, see my adult brother now. If your life is tight, check your tight. Now, I do uh, uh, apostle to talk that one. Their name, they yeah. me are not just me. Why it be say when pastors want to make you feel, feel insecure? When pastors, Ella, I greet, good evening. When pastors want to make you to be scared, when they want to take your power from you. They will put 
fear into your mind, into your conscience. Into your conscience. They will tell you, come and sow seed for, for your way to be open. They not go direct you to where you want to go pray or to which verse. Real Christians will direct you. Real pastors will tell you, go and open this verse. Go and pray with it. And you see, and then you know that God will open your way for you. But some, they will fall before they tell you. They will tell you, come and sow a seed. Come and sow a seed in this altar. Ima agreed. Good evening. They will tell you, come and sow a seed in this altar. As if that is where, you see why some people, we don't pray anymore. We don't pray anymore because we believe now that when we not put that, our 1,000 naira or 50 euro on top of that altar, our problem is solved. Many people don't pray anymore because the pastors don't use money, spoil everywhere. Some will even say, oh, so long I'm paying my tithe, I know everything, but they don't pray anymore. If problem they come, once problem come, we go sit around, go meet all those that the geo. Hey, I they pay my tithe, oh, problem come, oh. Now there, that the geo go constantly tell you, say, sow a seed. Sow a seed. Everything are seed. Everything are tight. Everything are offering. Everything are give. We need to open our eyes because now we, we, you, me, my dear sisters, now my brothers and sisters, now we use all these pastors, take on to second God for life. Now we give them the luxury way that they live. You go imagine some mama now. Some mama, me know a lot of mama those days for market. They know they call market. They go just open. They are so good. They open no. They don't go church. Ask money service. After no devotion, evening devotion, then go even the third person where near the shed say, Help me sell, oh, help me sell. But oh, you boy, where you bring the Christianity, come. Then all they do money devotion, after no devotion, evening devotion. Reverend Father, they work for abroad. Pastors, they go their normal duty for abroad, they go work, earn their salary. If they live above their income, police, they come, government, they come, come ask them, where they see the money? Where they see the money? Where they, they say they live above their income? Even tasks, they come after them. They ask them, where they, they see the money? Where they, they say they go? Now, church member go see, go report them. But our African, oh no, we see our African pastors like they are second God. We see them like they are second God. And now we put them there. Now all those things make, make our way be say, if they come, they seek, then go, they hide them. They're not going to let you know, say that they seek, because we don't put them as second God. You come, me now, be pastor. I can't give you my sticker. May you they pray to, through my seeker. Go on my seeker for what? Go on my seeker for yeah. Go on my use my olive oil with my seeker. Use and they pray. If me are the sick, I go come tell you say are the sick. Whereby me don't already brainwash you knowing fully where that through that my seeker you will get Christ. Door go open for you. Heaven go open for you. If any pastor they seek, they, will they come and tell you? No. Because we don't glorify them now. We glorify them, say they be God. Instead, sometimes when things you see some pastor, when we all they say, Oh, thank you, sir, they will be taking the glory. So we not even tell you all glory belong to God. They will claim the glory themselves. Many pastors will like to claim those glory to their own self. They will want to be the one in charge. But meanwhile, then they go drink paracetamol just like you and me. You go close from church 2 a.m. You go, they use leg, they walk out, they go in the night. But them, they know they go. When they see them, they go. If they want even come up for inside church, not be bodyguard, they follow them. Why is it so? Why are men of God not just free, just like you and me? Why are men of God? Make we they ask all this question, all this little, little command way be say, it's not clear for our eye. 
Why men of God not just they free like just you, like me? Say two o'clock, we close from church, middle of the night, with the use like the waka they go. Meanwhile, we don't pay our offering, we don't pay our tithe. But if they want to come out, bodyguard go follow them. The policemen go just they blow sarin, they follow them. Why now? Why? There are real men of God. Believe me, there are real men of God. But sometimes all these ones will be say they don't already put for themselves a big big position. Will be say now we now you me make all this mistake. That is one of the reason Africa remain poor today. Is one of the reason Africa remain poor because the people where even even if you look the Muslim world, it is still the same thing. The way where Africa take carry religion put for head, those that brought the religion, the Christianity, the, the Islam, uh, uh, Islam religions to us, they know they carry on the way where we Africans say they carry on. They don't take it that way. They know that you will pray to God, but you have to work for it. Somebody go say he want to become a millionaire. Okay, he get one thing where I see. Where even uh, our apostle brother, he said miracle money for your bank account. Una don't see him. I beg my people, una don't see angel they drop money for person bank account. Because me be one know the angel, whether na angel Michael or na angel Gabriel. Which angel can't drop money, magic and put for your own bank account? Now from one of our adult pastor aunt, we hear, see and say, Angel, they drop money for people back account. Maybe one give my own back account. Make the angel drop and put. The way we African we glorify men of God. If we are using that time, that energy to go also for work, I don't think poverty will be in Africa that much. I don't think Africans will be running away. You will spend two four seven in the church. 247, paying tight, paying off free, paying. If you go to church five times, now five times you go pay off free. I lie. I don't lie. If you go to church five times, now five times you go pay off free. Even for that five times, self, if they, they even they do conversion, then they do program for church. Now every day sowing of seed, sowing of seed. Now every day thing, that program go finish. The next thing you go, yes, say pastor day holiday for Dubai. But you wait, they do all those ones. You know day holiday. You not go holiday. You not go anywhere. I beg my people. Sometimes God not say make we not serve him. But we need to serve God with truth and love. Who don't they pay if you're tight? You can even go and read your Bible. I will bring the verse out. Go and read your Bible very well. You can even use your tithe to help people. God no go verse put. We don't need pastors to bring wash us that we must bring our tithe into the into that church. No. It is not compulsory that your tithe must go to that particular church. No, it's not compulsory. God not talking like that. Say he must be for that particular church. He must be for that your pastor hand. God not talking like that. God not still seeing her like that. God not talking like that. Now just because of greediness from a lot of pastors, now they begin doing that way. A lot of pastors now they begin changing that way so that he could favor them. Take back private jets. You will just see pastor under five years, he don't get private jet. Under three years, he don't get private jet. Under two years, he don't get different different car for their compound. Come on now. And now dear politicians go stick on the thief, they had the joiner for them. Politicians go call the thief, they had the joiner for them. I think for Pastor Chris House that day, I think I was, uh, uh, he got one uh, documentary where I see for his house, where, where he get about 50, I be 50 different kind of car. Ask me one person, where he want ride all those ones to go? Only one person. 
Get 50 car for your compound. Not to talk of other things. See, my people, the way way pastors, they do Christianity. Not be so God, they do Christianity. Make we read our Bible to be wise. Your Christianity, your Christianity. If you see Babi Allah for road, you know go one give her that money. You know go one give her that money, but you don't know whether or not Jesus Christ be that Babi Allah. But because pastor don't tell you, say, your tithe must be in the house of God, you go see Babi Allah for road, you know go one give her that money, but you don't know if that Babi Allah is Jesus Christ in human form. You will not miss your way, you will not miss your glory. Because your pastor don't already say, your tithe must be in the house of God. Your tithe must not, is not compulsory that it must be in one particular place. You can use your tithe to help orphanage home. After all, Jesus Christ was preaching about love. Jesus Christ was preaching about love. All Jesus Christ was saying is love. Love your neighbor. Love your neighbor. What does it mean by loving your neighbor? Love your neighbor. You love your neighbor. But if your neighbor can't beg you for money, you don't go one giver. But in the, the moment, you'll go use and sow seed for altar. How that altar won't open the door for you. We are by waiting God say make you do, you know they do one. How the altar one country open open the door for you? Whereby you don't already block your way with your neighbor. You don't already block your own way. You don't already block your own progress with your neighbor. Because we African people, we like to do eye service. We like to do eye service. We like to do notice me. We like to the art say, make pastor see us say, now we be the best Christians. We like to do say, make pastor know us. May pastor recognize us say, we are hard working in the house of God. But your neighbor go ask you, for one cup of rice, you go say you no get, but you get. You they go church, go down, sing hallelujah. You sure say God, you not sing. Say your neighbor just they ask you for one cup of rice. You get, but you say you no get. But now you, they inside church now. They dance, they jump up, they sing hallelujah. I will love my neighbor as myself. Where is the love there? Jesus Christ preached preach about charity. Charity covers everything. So don't let one person to brainwash you that, oh, you must, it, it is compulsory that your tithe must be in the house of God. No. If you see any beggar tomorrow, give her your money. You don't know if that your money will be the one to rescue him and save him alive. And God will thank you for it. Your door will open through that place. Then you see one beggar on the road and you refuse to give him or you refuse to help him. But you are taking your money to go and use it to sow seed. God not go answer. It good sometimes make we as a believer make we the strategize. Strategize. What did Jesus Christ preach about? It was just about love. Jesus Christ preached nothing else other than love. Love your neighbor as you love yourself. How are you going to love your neighbor when you are not helping your neighbor? So how will you not go to heaven? Then one pastor is not telling you that if you not pay your tithe, you not go go heaven. If you not pay your tithe, your door go close. If you not pay your tithe, eh, you not go make heaven. If you not pay your tithe, you go quit that. That guilty conscience, that is called brainwash tactics. Brainwash tactics. How many times Abraham pay tithe? How many times, anybody forgive me, how many times Isaac pay tight? We should start from there. We all should start from there. How many times did Abraham pay this tight? How many times did Isaac, when I don't read and say Isaac pay tight? How many times did Jacob pay his own tight? Even the Esau, how many times? We should start from there. My brothers and sisters, Christianity is read your Bible. Read your Bible to your own very understanding. And follow what God says. Know what men of God says. Because they are just men and women like you and I. They are also on hustling ground. Hustling ground. If you, they pray 247, they pray 247. God go see open your eyes. God can use anybody.
God can use anybody to so God who made me. God can use anybody. God can use anybody. God will use a, a child of two years old to come and save you and rescue you from your situation. God can use anybody. They, we are not born with it. They, there are some people that are really born with it. Right from baby, they begin to pray, prophesy, and all those things. There are people like that. But all this one, now look that day now. Look, there is a video I shared in my other page. Uh, Pastor uh, Bishop Oyedikbo said they employed. Can you imagine? He used the word, we employed 7,000 pastors for all our churches. Employed. So it means those pastors we are not called by God. Unadosia. If somebody employ you, automatically that person that employed you is your boss. Who employ you now be your boss? So now my people now, Bishop Yedikbo said they employed the 7,000 pastors. So anyone where you know you eat anything, not bring anything, come. They still get right to take sack them. Now so Christianity be, I thought they said uh, when you have the calling of God. So meaning you and I can carry Bible and go and meet our, our fatherly bishop and ask him to employ us too. When I see now, the way Christianities are going. But me and you now, we go see Chris, we go see church for roads. Where it be said, they don't even get zinc. Now, Babo, they tell you what are they beat and then get the revenge. If they say, make we come sit down there, we go even commonalize them. We go come out. We they go look for church where you get AC and everything. Now, all those ones that they tell they catch us. But me, why who use Babo stick? That one might be preaching love. He might be preaching the real doctrine of God. He might be telling you what God wants you to believe and what God wants you to do. Not uh, uh, if you not pay tax, you go go air fire. Who don't see the air fire? May them describe the air fire. May them describe heaven. When I not say many book, not the Bible, many book, like the book of Enoch. How many of you have read the book of Enoch? I, for one, have read it. The book of Enoch is not added to the Bible. But Enoch walked with God. Not be with the year. Enoch walked with God. But Enoch has his own book also. A good sometimes make with a use. You know, when, when, I just believe, say, now our, Yes, Christianity has become business. One man show. Family business. Family business. If they die, they go one made their first son take over, second son take over. Okay, see that then are some pastors. When they say, uh, Oyedikbo discharge them, he, he, he sack them. But meanwhile, they say he first became a pastor from your own church. How many souls in his first son don't win come the church? How many he four son don't win come that in your own church? But meanwhile, the papa don't get big daughter, big uh, uh, big space, uh, big uh, 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 people there. Where he be say, if he die tomorrow, now the son go take over there. So how many souls the the picking come win come? Whereby he papa don't already walk and down give him. The papa don't already walk and down give him. Say if I stop here, continue. The picking no need to work hard. But the pastors will be saying, No, they're not gonna work hard now. The papa begins sack them. Can the father tell the old world that his first son, his first son, that the first son is winning so into the church every month? He no go fit talk because he don't already work and down. He don't already work and down for his speaking. So by tomorrow now, once he may God let him live long, if he come out there now, if he if he is entire, he begin go take over. Once he begin take over, he begin go continue for where he stop. But the thing when he come back for me where he talks, he, they employ seven thousand pastors. Employ. So pastors, we those pastors we are not just called by God. Now somebody just trained them, trained them, say, okay, just go here, now start, I employ you, now go and be preaching. My people, we all should be wise.
or Igbo way bring Christianity come. Many of them not they go to church, eh? But now they give pass. They know the year where they, 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 they say donate, help orphanage, help foundation, help this. Where we they know they put their money. They, they always they put their money. And many of them, their money in Africa, they come. Or you bought where they receive 1,000 euro in a month. That or you bought go see fee squeeze 100 euro after a bill and everything. Sacrifice his own self. See, send the money, bring and come Africa, make the tea happy. But our African pastors, they are all living lavish life with private jets and different kind of things. I beg my people. Now this one, I say may I talk. I don't want to stay long this evening. But I just want us to open our eye. Don't feel bad. Don't have a guilty conscience. Say It is a month. Say, oh, I not pay my tithe for a church. Oh. It's not compulsory. Any church where you reach, go pay your tithe today. If you feel like if you feel like say you want to use your tithe, take help human being. As Jesus Christ preached, love your neighbor as you love yourself. Charity. Charity, they say, begins at home. Not be the one where be say, you not help your neighbor for his house. Cup of soup, cup of water, you not give. But you they go dance inside church. You they go sow seed of 500 naira. You they go do tithe of 2,000 naira. You they go pay all free of 300 naira. But at the end of the day, you go come inside. Your neighbor, they die. They, they cry, they go. Now all those ones, help your neighbor first. Before you go dance with your cocoa shoe for inside church. Those are the things that Jesus preached. He preached love. He preached love. He not preached money. Money, 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 money. As all these men of God, they preach. And meanwhile, none of them don't see heaven. None of them don't even see the earth. Air fire. They never see her. They not go. Baba Kingsley, I greet. Longest time. The pastors, the men of God, they never see the, 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 the air fire. They never see the heaven. But they go tell you, say, if you not pay your tax, you they go air fire. Ask me, make one ask him whether you know how the air fire be. The way where Africans stay take religion, eh? Religion is the biggest problem that destroyed Africa. We should say the truth. Both the Christian and the Muslim, the religion destroyed this, our African culture. It destroyed Africa. Religion destroyed Africa. Because oh, you both way bring the Christianity come. Arab world way get the Muslim. Go see Arab world now. Dubai not be Arab world. You sure said they not they go mosque there. Just the way where be say our Africans we take take religion. Then they go, but then they see they walk. Then they walk. Some people go just close shop for one week. One week he go close shop. All because of crusade, crusade, crusade. Meanwhile, the money where you don't say for the past two months. You want to put all of them for that one week. You go spend all. All the society want to grow. And we are the pastors way be say, then they invest the money on. The pastor in return are not investing on those people. You not go come to church one Sunday service say, ah, every church, uh, 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 seat for inside church, you see one, one bag of rice. In no day. Say you see one one bag of rice, tomatoes and everything on top of on, on under your bench or on top of your bench. You say ah, you are come surprised. Say hey, now our pastor do so. He no day, he no day, he no day. Okay, pastor now we can get seven thousand branches all over the world. You know sure say all those people, everybody where they go to church now. The church where did they go to? I mean, go can receive your own salary there too. You go can receive your own salary there. You just see man of God where he be say, he not get anything. He was living in one room before. Before you know it, under two, three years, he don't buy a car. He don't come out. He don't go flat. From flat, he don't go in your house. How all these things still they happen? Now magic. Now magic. I mean, why you know they walk out? You know they go work, say, uh, maybe if month hands, you go receive salary. You know they go work. How all these things say they happen, our African brothers and sisters? Make we begin to start from there, they ask ourselves question. 
who did one room before, all of a sudden, you will see saying a flat, you can't do, now pastor. You will come see the latest car, now he hand you go day. Sometimes we make ourselves also to be lazy. We make ourselves to be lazy because we know they pray by ourselves. We know they pray by ourselves. Seek ye first the kingdom of God. Every other thing shall be added unto you. So whatever you see from God, God will give you. You know me say it must be true man of God. It is good you have a man of God. It is good you have a pastor. It is good you have a, 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 a that the geo that you can call and you can rely on. But you also as a you normal a, 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 as a person work towards your salvation also, because you you feel they go heaven. You go wave and for your pastor for a fire. You feel see the road, your pastor will be saying, they tell you now, say, if you not pay tax, you go go air fire. You feel bad now, say, if truly, then go get the air fire. Because the money where they collect, they know they use and help humanity. They know they use and help humanity. They know they preach love, now money that they preach. No love, now money. I bet my people, make we wise up. Read your Bible. Know what you have to do. Help the poor. Help the poor. If your family member cries, say, ah, my picking the sick or this thing, the same. If you get, bring, give them. Believe me, give them. Give them. It's not a crime that if you don't come pay to your tight, because you don't already use that money as a tight on that child that is sick. God's not be everything the way where we human they take the calculator and say, ah, if I do this, God go verse. If I do that, God go verse. Because our African pastors, they don't bring washers rich like that. They don't bring washers rich like that. That sometimes if we don't sleep good, we go call. If we don't feed it, we go call. The brainwash tactics it don't too much. I know say many of them go see come here later, come attack me. Uh -huh. But to me, I know. I'm okay. I don't talk my own. I don't talk my own. Christianity is all about love. It's not about money. All these that the Jew, all these big, big pastors, they should remove money from it and let the common man be free. Let the common man, the poor people be free. And they themselves, they cannot walk alone. They're not going to feel waka. If you with them, they waka, you go they waka freely. But they cannot. They cannot. Make we open our eye. You come, man of God, he pray for you. It's no problem. It's fine. But it's not a do or, a do or die affair that you must pay tight. If you not pay tight, that uh, 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 insecurity or fear, they come put out for your mind. Say, if you not pay tight, you go die. You not go die. Nobody, they go a fire. Not be so God, they talk and be way, way. They say, my propose, God dispose. Make we the user like that. My propose God dispose. So it's like that. Whichever way then they see and say, if you don't bring that tight come, you go go and fire. God feed your see and say, if you don't bring the tight come, use and take help another person, you go get blessing from her. So that is just it, my people. Thank you all so much. God bless you all. I call it a day, yeah? Till we meet for another Ogboge. No, the truth, the truth, uh, Baba Numa, it is difficult for them all. Many are really, 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 really now uh, uh, kind of. He got a video where the man now, he don't delete the video. Because he got one man that day now where he say uh, that they threaten in life. Because in question, say, he reports another pastor. Say, the pastor, they, they say, uh, 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 miracle money. Miracle money, me no know with the angel. The pastor too, they ask, say, which angel can they pay the money for people account? May the pastor wait, they say miracle money, make it bring a comma. They can't they threaten in life. Pastors can't they threaten another pastor life. Now, so Christianity can't turn to this days. If you talk to one pastor, the other pastor go contract, the pastor where you talk to, he go can't they threaten your life. It's not good now. Now, so that one are Jesus Christ preaching. No. Nine, the, the pastor now don't delete the video. Maybe they don't see Setora now. He don't delete the video because I'll be sharing that day. I just forget to save her. 
Because I even, because of, I even make this topic this evening, but I reach there now. He don't delete the video. Then they try to now, why he talk, come out. Say another pastor, they do miracle money. Miracle money for your bank account. When I don't see as soon as they this abroad, say miracle, miracle money go just vanish. It go just enter your account. Bah. Ever since maybe those way they are brought, when I don't see miracle money like that, we change it. Sometimes some of us want us those pastors. May that they give us the angel. Make we to they pray to the angel. Miracle money. The angels are donating money to your account. Me, why not then? They go tell you, bring your account number, come out. Who no go fit transfer money into people account? Whereby about you, they talk, um, maybe about 50 people sit down for back uh, uh, one room. Then any account number where it come, then pack up, then they transfer money, they go there because you open one account. Who no go fit do that one? Make we know they see everything, miracle money, God, now God, they, they, uh, angel, they deposit money for people account. It's not good. I beg my people, the way where Africa they take religion and now religion damage Africa. And these people where bring religion come Africa, they not do Africa way. Believe me. They not do Africa way. They just know the way where they will take culture Africa. And our black now way be said they can't be the top top pastor. They can't the user now they oppress the common man. Also, my people, now do where? For abroad, or you both pass or they go work. Then they work, then they receive their salary. Then not they get more than one car. Oh my good night.